Hey guys, it's Crystal and Gabby and today, today we're, we're doing, doing the, the iPhone, iPhone photo, photo challenge. challenge. Gabby recently got her iPhone 15 so now that we're both on that 15 life I thought it'd be fun to do a friendly little sister versus sister photo competition. Crystal's in LA and I'm in New York City so we're gonna take photos in two of the best cities we have a lot to work with but we have to choose three different locations to take our photos today. Now technically I do have a little advantage because I have the 15 Pro Max so I do have one more camera on here but the iPhone 15 still has an incredible camera system even though it doesn't have Pro in the name you can still take a lot of Pro photos and videos. The rules are simple. Three photos at each location. We have to choose three places that will make for some awesome looking photos. The winners will be chosen by you guys on Instagram. And if you didn't get a chance to submit your answers there, you can tell us who you think going down below. And make sure you're following us for the next one. As far as type of photos, each location will require three different photo types. A photo of us as a subject, a selfie, and a freestyle photo of whatever we would like. Taking a good photo is truly the only rule, so let's go. Okay. Oh, guys, it is so cold. I am freezing. Crystal thinks her only advantage. Pause for the helicopter. Crystal thinks her only advantage is using the iPhone 15 Pro, but let me tell you, it is freezing out here. I'm having trouble even moving my hands, so wish me luck. Location number one for me is Santa Monica Pier. I feel like when I think of places in Los Angeles that really stand out that probably everybody visits I think Santa Monica and by the beach so let's see what we can get here so it is day two of the iPhone photo challenge for me and we are in a bit of a change of plans because my next location was going to be the High Line but every single entrance is closed so what can you do it's okay on to the next I'm gonna see where I end up. I'll keep you posted. There's endless of pictures I could take here in the city. So we're fine. We're fine. Okay guys, so I am here in Chelsea at the vessel, but it quickly became nighttime on us. You know, we're dealing with those winter hours where it becomes dark at like 4 p.m. So hopefully we can capture something. Fingers crossed. Made it to location number two. We are at the lovely Griffith Observatory in Griffith Park. I feel like this is a great photo spot. We got the Hollywood sign right back here. My only concern is that there's always a lot of people here, so it is harder to take pictures, but let's see what I can get. So I'm at the subway, which I know might seem like a little bit of a random location for my photo, but it's really not because it captures the city essence. Am I right? I'm just hoping this all works out in the end. It is photo reveal time. I'm going to FaceTime Gabby on my MacBook Pro here, and we're gonna send each other the photos that we shot so that we can react to them together and see who did a better job. Hello, hello. <laughs> hello, hello. You ready for this? I am not. I am ready, but I tried my darndest best. The moment has come. After looking at some of the photos, I was like, hmm, maybe I went a little bit too artsy, but. <laughs> oh no. I don't know if that's a good thing. <laughs> oh no. I definitely feel like for me, it's the opposite. I'm like, I wish I could have gone artsier. I was dealing with a lot of low light photos, a lot of night, but I believe in the New York like vibes. So hopefully that'll help me out a little. So we had three different photos to take in three different locations and the rules are really open-ended. And as far as editing, we were allowed to edit in the stock camera app, in the photos app and Lightroom. So those are our only two little editing things that we can do, but nothing crazy in Lightroom, no healing brush, no you know altering the photo, just any different like color or lighting touches that we wanted to add to add some style and flair, but we're keeping it really, you know, simple. It was really just take a good photo and that's it. Oh, frick. <laughs> I 
mean, that's like a bit, wow. Wow, I love this. Mine was like, you know, like I feel like you knew I was gonna go there, like LA, like. I was like, she has to go to like a beachy area at some point. This, like that shot was made for like the ultra wide camera. Like you can't go wrong with it there, especially with all the lines and the symmetry and just the framing of the photo. It looks so good. Yours has a lot of symmetry too. I love your smack like in the center and that shadow coming down is just like so pleasing to look at. And the colors in that photo, I'm like, wow. These are these are both really solid like starters. Brooklyn Bridge, Santa Monica Pier, can't go wrong with yeah. either. So many bridges I could have gone to. In New York City, there's endless yeah. bridges, but I was like, Brooklyn Bridge will be the one today. Yeah, and also the most crowded, so I don't know how you managed to make it look like you were just solo there. Yeah, right. <laughs> like my photo has people in it, yours doesn't. So I feel like you get the upper hand there because of that, but. That's tough. Okay, photo number two. Wow! <laughs> oh my gosh. Shoot. I could tell it was cold because you have a red nose, like Rudolph the Red Nosed Reindeer and red rosy cheeks. <laughs> You're gonna see that trend remain with me. Like my face was like red everywhere. Let me appreciate this selfie though. It's so cute. There's so much happening. Like I feel like I'm looking at an ad photo for iPhone. It's a, what's the word I'm looking at? It's a portrait selfie, right? You know how you have portrait control? Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. So I added that to the after. Wow. I was like, how can I make this a little more oomph? And I did that. I literally dropped my phone to the ground. Like I literally just went plop and there was <laughs> a little circle of palm trees and I just, you know, faced, literally was like facing, yeah, facing up. But yours is really, I mean, yours is classic. And you, like you look at that and you're like, oh, she's in the city. You know, iconic areas of the city. Good job, love it, love it. Good job to you, Inmana. <laughs> Whoa, wait, I feel like that's some trippy stuff going on. I'm like, Lifting with the bumble. And wow, that's such a perfect, yours is really strong. Like the lines are perfect. That you, you have two people walking there, which are, the, they look like a little like couple walking in New York. Yeah, they, they were, I was like, thank you couple, shout out to you. Perfect timing. I would have liked, I would have stopped those people and said, look, I took a good photo of you guys, you want it? <laughs> <laughs> right, yeah, they'd be like, uh, please delete. No, and you know what I love about this? Like, it's just like straight, you know, like straight from that camera, it's still so strong. Like you captured literal movement in a photo. So that's gonna give you points because it's like artistic. Oh, Rick. Whoa, wow, Crystal, you're so good. Crystal, she won like this round. <laughs> the literal like model-esque, I feel like I'm looking at a actual magazine cover of this photo. Wow. I, I seriously, I swear by the telephoto camera comes through and I know you don't have that on your phone, yeah. <laughs> but it really comes through. Like I, Just it's one of my favorite cameras to shoot on now. Like I feel like you're in Paris or something or in like Greece. <laughs> It looks like you're in Greece. But yours is also the vessel, again, like it's one of those like staple, like go-to spots and the lights and everything really tie. Also the fact that you're wearing like blue jean jacket, that was a good little color choice pop. Thank separating you. the warm and cool. I really love this photo. Oh my gosh, it looks like you're in like Italy or Rome or something, <laughs> what the heck? So you took this one before then, so the light was still coming yeah. through, you have that blue. Yeah. That's that's a solid selfie. That was that 20 minute span of, you know, like the sun's going down and every minute it looks yeah. just completely different. Yeah. But it's very New York. I also love that the Christmas like tree or like the little lighted trees are still up there. Photo number three. Wow, I mean, you have to show the location. That's oh, a lovely wow. wide angle. I feel like when you have city buildings, you have to use a wide angle. Like that's like, yeah. you can't go wrong with a wide angle. I love how interesting these pictures are that you took though. It's so cool. Like I really focused heavily on like what the location was, but yours like shows the locations through different. Like a different perspective, like, you know, telescopes are so staple to Griffith. Without a doubt, I'll take the L that round. That was just so interesting. We will see what they say. 
in the story. So Guys, I'll forgive you, I guess. <laughs> Wait, we're not, it's not over yet. We still have the third location. I gotta send another one. I'm gonna send you a location photo first. I just wanna show you where I was. <laughs> okay. No. You went to Big Bear? <laughs> yes. I was like, how can I throw this off? Because I know you had the cold. I went into the cold. And technically, this is out of the Los Angeles area. But when you think of LA, the beauty here is that you can like drive an hour and you're in the snow. And that, that is, is cool. that is what I did. I, I went to the snow. <laughs> you guys at home, give her a round of applause for that one. She really traveled. <laughs> Oh, wow. wow, the subway. Oh, that is such a good idea. You know, when I thought it, I didn't even like think like that's a, such a perfect photo place and people take photos like crazy photos all the time and I just didn't even think that you would. Oh my gosh, that's so clever. Outfit on point with your famous thrifted jacket from Brooklyn. <laughs> from Brooklyn, guys, it comes through. Go to the Dumbo market. I'm telling you, it comes through. It. Let me tell you, it was a big struggle to get an empty subway photo like that. <laughs> but wow, okay, I have so much to say. I haven't seen a sunset like that in a minute. Literally was like the focus of my photos in Big Bear because like I was just like waiting, even though I got like pretty little daylight photos. I was like, oh, the sunset is like strong. So let's send the selfie for this one. Oh my, look, another cute little photo oh, by Crystal. Look at you, just so cute as ever. Your little winter get up. I love this, I love this, I love this again. Like the snow, the trees, the little hat, the cozy jacket. I love yours. I mean, that was like such a perfect little moment. Was it about to move? I believe so. Oh yeah, it was, yeah, because the, the light is red. You're wearing the Yankees hat. Like it's just really repping New York. I need to see these photos up. Photo number three, I'm torn. I also have two. Can we just choose each other's third? <laughs> okay, let's do that. Let's send two, let's send two. <laughs> Wow. I just can't. Model I Gabby can't. modeling in the subway cart. It's Wait, there is no way that you were like you took that photo and ran out. Yeah. There is no like how long was it open for? And no, literally two minutes. Dude, that was like oh position, position. <laughs> love, love both. I the sitting down one is just so like I love that. I can't get over the scenery over there is gorgeous. Like Big Bear has so much to capture, so much to offer. And like from the trees to the skyline of like the mountain, oh, it is such a wallpaper. Like I definitely am saving all of these pictures. I literally did that. Like look at my wallpaper rotation. Whoa. Something about that sky gradient in that sunset, like the yellow to the gray is just so absolutely pleasing to my eye that I'm like, I have to pick it. I can't let it like go without I the people that. saying. I see that. Which one did you choose for my last two? I told you the sitting down one. Oh, did you? I didn't hear that. <laughs> Honestly, to me, we both won. It was just such a fun little photo challenge. I definitely want to do these more. I just think it's a yes. great way to showcase the differences between these two cameras, but also showcase how much they both shine. I'm so happy with these photos and I'm so excited for the next one. I'm already ready, I'm plotting. I look forward to beating you again. <laughs> Excuse her. You know what guys, vote for me. Go hard down there in the comments. The true winner is determined in the comments. Let us know. Yes. Let us know. Please realize all my struggles and all my attempt. Thank you. Please I love you all. And on that, adios. Hasta luego. Thank you guys Thank so much you. for watching. Don't forget to subscribe and hasta luego.